ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன் ஐம் சில்வியா பிகாம் ஜென்ரல் பி செக்ஷன் ஃப்ரம் மகாலட்சுமி விமன்ஸ் காலேஜ் ஆஃப் ஆர்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் சயின்ஸ் ஹேம் யூர் டு டாக் அபவுட் த புக் வென் வேவ்ஸ் ஃபெல் சைலண்ட் இட் வாஸ் ரிட்டன் பை மிஸ்டர் மென்னான் உன்னிகிருஷ்ணன் நவ் லெட்ஸ் சி அபவுட் த ஆத்தர் மிஸ்டர் மென்னான் உன்னிகிருஷ்ணன் ஹே ஸ்டடிட் இங்கிலீஷ் லிட்ரேச்சர் அண்ட் ரூரல் டெவலப்மெண்ட் ஹீ ஹேஸ் ஒர்க்டு ஃபார் த்ரீ டீகேட்ஸ் இன் ஆல் இந்தியா ரேடியோ ஆஃப் அண்ட் ட்ரான்ஸ்ஃபரிங் ஃப்ரம் பிளேஸ் டு பிளேஸ் டியூ டு இஸ் ஒகேஷன் டூ ஆஃப் இஸ் ப்ரொடக்ஷன்ஸ் ஆவ் ஏர்ன் நேஷ்னல் ரெகக்னேஷன் ஃபார் ப்ரோக்ராம் எக்ஸலன்ஸா நவ் லெட்ஸ் சி வாட் இன்ஃப்ளூவன்ஸ்டு த ஐடியா ஆஃப் திஸ் புக் ரிட்டைர்மெண்ட் ஆர் சர்வீஸ் மெனோபாஸ் ஆஸ் அட்ரெஸ்ட் பை த ஆத்தர் த டேர்ம் விச் மீன்ஸ் த டைம் வென் ஒன் டிபார்ட்ஸ் அ ஒர்க் ஃபோர்ஸ் தே வேர் எங்கேஜ்டு வித் இட் ரெப்ரஸன்ஸ் த எண்ட் ஆஃப் சம்திங் ரைட் பட் ஹியர் த ஆத்தர் turned the very symbolism of this word and grabbed it as an inspiration for starting the making of this book this book is a collection of all those remembrances and years spent recollected while serving the last 100 days of super annuation which starts a day before christmas everyone has a different reckoning about this phrase of life as some look upon it as the end of young and carefree time walking towards old age beginning of a danging life on some shatter the shiro types and contemplate it as a recourse of new outset of the better and essay going life now let's see what does this book comprise in this book master arthur Mr Menon Unnikrishnan converses about his experience of working in the media industry and what impact it induced on his individuality and customary life. The author is of the personality who believes in as long as we are alive we are working whether on ourselves or the things we crush. This industry has leaped in 30 years including a changes associated with the working technique in word system a core principles and many more the author has disseminated numerous personal experiences of his work life some of which he is proud of while some are pessimistic in one instance he shared how he couldn't completely enjoy any of his holidays without getting troubled with work and work calls and i felt every working persons of any era can relate to us many situations described here are easily relatable which i appreciated while reading the books when waves fell silent remarkably exhibits how human life has to redefine its purpose and significance form time to time and how retirement helps people to see it differently to live for themselves for once and finally it ends it ironic the things we count has an ending is actually a beginning waiting to be grabbed by someone hopeful while reading this book getting irritated by the theme i looked into other books with the same topic but what differentiates this book from all other retirement books out there is the fundamental idea the denomination there is a journey of human emotion from one part of life to another keeping an aside the factors related to money or investment it talks about moral sentiments job life home roads that leads to the office the college years regular work the identity one is leaving behind and such little things which one may not pay he to in haste I recommend this book to this part memorial illustrates a mixed relationship between human beliefs along with life's community and how it shapes our journey to the end I would suggest this books to all those people who have worked in the media industry and have precisized system changes and are inclined to know what it brings out of people 
even beginners or those who are interested in working in the same field and reading notifications can read this given their knowledge of vocabulary should be intact as the author has used rich language throughout the book my conclusive criticisms the title of the book was initial thing that caught my attention it felt surreal and real at once this topic was new and unusual for my taste and i grabbed it as an opportunity to rediscover my liking i rejoiced to go through day to day life of the author and got to know a lot about how things work in this field if i fell down or stuck at some places it was because of some over descriptions done as i am not a fan of slow paced narration this book is straight from the heart of the author with the tying of fiction making it an appealing and engaging read the author may consider it as a tale of an unknown indian but isn't every tale untold till the author uh, author holds the pen and all that life lived starts flowing through it thank you